Hi, we're back and we're going to do an Obsessions. We haven't done one in how long, babe? A year, two years? Oh my god, it's been such a long time. And we used to do them so like... Every uh, month? More? Was it? Oh yeah, because yeah. it was like September. Month, oh my god, I forgot about that. Oh my, it's been a while then. Right, okay. Let us know if you guys want that. Again. Let us know if you want monthly Obsessions. Um, right now we're going to do a beauty one. So listen up, ladies. Things I have absolutely loved I use these products almost every day and let me tell you, they're life changing. So let's start. <laughs> I'm excited. I'm excited to share it with you guys. Um, outfit, I can't link it. I know you guys always ask, so I'm just gonna get this out of the way now. These are from Ross. They're amazing. They're flowy. They're long. They move with you. I love them. They're cute. Um, and I got another floral one. No, it wasn't floral. It was plant green. Um, so yeah, I can't link them, but Ross, go there. You'll find nice stuff. Okay, let's jump into this. Um, I don't know where to begin. Let's start with Squirrel Lash. Squirrel Lash, Squirrel Lush. This is how much I love them. So these are the ones I'm currently using, and these are my backups. I have it on subscribe and save. That's how much I love it. I don't... Has it been a full year? Possibly. Mm -hmm. So I've been using it for a year. Now, I saw the ad on Instagram and you know, I had, I had seen it over and over and a lot of people were like, oh my God, I saw results in two weeks and blah, blah, blah. And it sold me on it. But let me tell you my personal experience, it took longer than two weeks. Okay, I had to be really patient with it. And I think it like two months in, I was like, damn. But like two weeks, no, I didn't, I wasn't enough to like sell me on the product. Um, but their volumizing mascara, let me tell you, it makes your lashes look even longer. And what I love about it is it's not the type that if you get wet or you get teary eyed, it's going to smudge and leave like black all over your eyes. It comes off like in a full, I can't even explain it, but the whole like product just comes off, you know? I think you ladies probably know, like if you use the ones that have like the fibers, and then and when you clean them off, they just it just comes off and that's it. There's no smudging or anything. So I love it for that reason. Obviously, I have my backup all the time. I use this morning and night. And yeah, I, I say it definitely helped, but let me also share my Lux Lash. I've got a lot of stuff here. You're not gonna need this much, but I want to explain. So first, I bought their set. The, it's supposed to include everything. It has a little pamphlet, which isn't in here. Is it this one? Yeah, it's this one. And it tells you how to do it. I bought a lash perming kit probably two or three years ago and I never used it because I was really scared that I would fry my lashes, go blind, or I don't know, do something <laughs> horrible. I ended up throwing it away because it expired and I had never used it. I watched a bunch of videos of theirs also Instagram. Damn, Instagram sells me a lot of things. Huh. Saw it there a lot, often, frequently, because once you click on it, they keep showing it to you. And I'm like, you know what? I'm just going to try it. I tried it. It was so easy. I kind of goofed up a little because online has really weird information like don't get your lashes wet, which is bullshit. You need to wash off the product. If you leave it on, they will over curl. And that's what happened with me. They were like curling into my eyelids a little too much. They were going straight up. <laughs> Not straight up, they were like literally like yeah, into sorry. my eyelids. And I'm like, mm, I think I did something wrong. And it was because I didn't wash it off, I wiped it off. Because that's what everything online said. No, wash your damn lashes. And you have to wait wash like, like and, and two somebody, weeks, right? Somebody said like, this is just the way that lash people go and tell people, oh, if it didn't work, it's because you got water on them. It's like a way to cover their asses, I hear. Um, but they're like, no, it's bullshit. You go dye your hair and guess what? They wash it out. You go perm your hair and they wash it out. You will have to wash out the product. So that was a big mistake. Um, it comes with like three things. It's the perming lotion, perm lotion, fix lotion, and nourishing lotion. Once I got the kit, I, I did need it. I needed the pamphlet. I still read the pamphlet, even though I've done it four times now, just as a refresher, and it tells you exactly how much time you need to leave everything on. So for that reason, I do, if you've never done it, get the big kit. You'll, you won't regret it. But then after that, all you have to do is buy the refills, because you don't really need all the other stuff in there, and it's a lot cheaper. Like, this is $39 versus $19, you know? And um, it lasts for two months. 
and you have three in here, so you're set for six months um, for $19. It's not bad at all. So then you can just get that. Um, I will say I needed to play with the sizing of the lash. They give you some, but I didn't use them. I went and bought my own. Um, these are the things that like will determine how much your lash will curl. And I use small because again, reading things online, everyone's like, use the smallest ones, you get the best curl. But my lashes were long, and then getting the biggest curl made them curl back into Come my eye. Let me show your eye. Your and eye. so, huh? Your eye. Let me show them. Looks good. What my lashes look like? Yeah. Thank you, baby. I mean, I haven't done it. I'm due to do it, actually. Um, so, I mean, I, I was trying to do it before the video, but, you know, with time and everything, it just didn't work out that way. But I'm due to do it. Uh, I have to do it. So, I got these, and I will... I don't know what the name of the brand is. I got them on Amazon. I will link them for you. Um, and then I found the perfect size that works for me. If you have long lashes, do not use the extra small. Use the medium, man. Thank me later, because I had to wait two months, because that's how good it works, two months for my lashes to not be curled into my eyelids. Anyways, uh, the tint set. Now this one, I have not had to buy a replacement because you only need a very little bit. It's half and half. You put it in a little cup and you put it on your lashes after that, or you can do it um, the next day if you want. If you do it right after the lash perm, only three minutes, but if you do it without the lash perm, you gotta do it for 20 minutes. And um, I kinda like to do it without that because I just feel like this is already time consuming and then it, you gotta wait, I know three minutes, but then application and then removal, it adds time, you know what I mean? Um, so I do this separate and you could do it in between and how many times you want and it'll coat all your blonde lashes and really make them pop. Love it, love it, this was a great investment. I'm happy I waited though and I was patient and I watched a lot of videos before doing it myself. Moving on, ah, I love this. So I look crazy when I have it on. They call me Oompa Loompa around the house when I'm, I have it on. I do a lot of masks, I love masks. I do the Korean mask, sheet face masks, everything. But this one specifically, it's got shea butter in it. It moisturizes your skin so much, it gives you like this brilliance. And you only need to have it on for five minutes. I do it right before I do my makeup. I love it so much. Yes, I have it on subscribe and save on Amazon and I got another one. I can tell a difference when I've used this prior to putting my makeup on versus when I don't and my skin is kind of duller. And then you see uh, more lines and I don't know, I just, when I use it, I just feel like a glowing goddess. Love it. Hair. Okay. I have fine hair, but lots of hair. But, like, it's fine. Like, if you take a strand of my hair, you're like, damn, girl, I can barely see it. You know, so it's like, it's like skinny. Um, and because of that, I don't always get the volume that I want. Um, I was losing a lot of hair due to having Kai and then, you know, postpartum, I just kind of went bald, but I found a root boosting spray, which again, love it so much, subscribe and save. Um, it lifts your hair and it stays that way until you wash it again. So I put it in with wet hair and then I blow dry it and you only need to focus it like literally on your roots. So I'll like divide my hair, spray, 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 and then I blow dry my hair like this. And when I come back up, it's like, whoo, it's beautiful. And it does last. And if you still feel you need a little bit more, dry texture spray. I also add this, which helps give you that lift. Um, it will make your hair not feel like, like right now I have nothing, so it feels very smooth and I can run my hands through it a lot. Once you have this in, it kind of makes it a little bit harder to run your hands through, but it does give you that lift. So I'll only use it for like a special occasion where you I you know, really want that lift, but on an everyday base, I like to do this, you know, and play with my hair. So I don't use this one all the time, but I do use this one every time I wash my hair. Love it. Moving on, Essie Nail Polish. If you've seen my snaps on Instagram, um, I found a beautiful, okay, so I was curious about their new uh, Couture line, Gel Couture. It's not gel polish, but it works like gel polish, if that makes sense. I've tried everything, dips, gel, nothing lasts on me. And I'm like, why, what is wrong with me? I clean, I work out, I do a lot of hands-on stuff, so I feel like that's why nothing ever lasts. I got a whole week out of this. 
a whole week. Right now, I, as an experiment, I used one of their older ones with the gel top just to see if this is the magic or if I have to use that. I'm going four days with this one and no chips. I've been washing, cleaning. I went to an amusement park with the kids, sliding down, being a goofball, doing everything, and they have not, can you see it? No. Is it hard to focus? No. And they have not chipped at all. Let me tell you, it's that top coat. So if you just want to invest in the top coat, say you have like a bunch of polish you love, get their top coat. Um, but I will get other colors and really put it to the test and see if, if it makes a huge difference. But this color combo is gorgeous. Um, so Essie nail polish, and I kind of transitioned to Essie so I don't have a lot. I was an Orly fan, but it would only last me like two days and I had to redo it because I look like a teenager who <laughs> didn't take care of herself and my nails were all chipped and stuff and I didn't like that. Um, so eventually I got off Orly even though I've spent so much money on Orly and I went into Essie. Um, here's another Obsessions. Is this not... Oh, <laughs> is this not amazing? I love it. Especially for us ladies, we're always digging for stuff. It's always everywhere. So it's like a simple, you know, found it. Okay, maybe not that aggressive. It didn't make you keep your stuff more clean. More organized and yeah. clean, yeah. I would not put them up on the shelf because it's like, oh, I'm going to use it again. I'm going to use it again. Then I'd have to go digging for it. And so it would end up like around the sink. And I'm and like, was, I don't like this clutter. It was so easy for Kai to grab things. And take it yeah. Anymore. So now that I had this, it's easy to find what I'm looking for. And things I use on the daily, I just put them in there. And I don't have to like put them around the sink. So it's a great or And you know what? I thought about it really long and hard. Because I'm like, is this going to look dumb on my sink? Is it not going to be useful? Is everything going to be out like this? But this is just because of the video. <laughs> You know, but I'm like, is this what's gonna happen? But no, it actually works really well. I love it. Now last, but not least, my absolute favorite, I have to use it every single day, is my cashmere body butter. Now I go between this one and the oil. I like the oil for summer, and I like the butter when it starts to feel a little bit more dry. Um, it just feels a lot more moisturizing. It's amazing. I get complimented on my skin all the time. It looks glowy, it's so nice, it's so moisturized, so even. Guys, you need to moisturize your skin. <laughs> I, uh, girls, I know we do our face and everything, um, but think about it, long term, if your skin is always dry, it's always cracked, it's never taken care of, it's gonna age quicker, right? So people who are drier tend to age faster than people who are well moisturized. So oily girls, embrace it because you will not have wrinkles as somebody who has dry skin. And that's why they have to use moisturizers and lotions and everything to keep their skin nice and plump and glowing and moisturized. Um, so it's religious for me. I need to do it every day. The scent. Everyone tells me I smell amazing. <laughs> every time my daughter hugs me, she inhales me. It's, it's goofy, and I do love the scent. This is the scent that I have been true to. It's the one I use all the time. Um, I give my neighbors it so they can try it out, and they also love the scent. It's, it's very mild, but it stays with you, and it's a little bit sweet, but not very sweet. And my husband uses it on his dry cracks to be. <laughs> Well, I know, but kidding aside, it works really well. It's shea butter, it moisturizes you really, really good. Um, and how has it been working for you? Good. Good? It works really good. But you don't put it on your body, because I could, I could never get him to moisturize. <laughs> I just finally got him to start using oil on his face, rose hip oil on his face. I make him with tea tree oil, because he loves tea tree oil. Um, and now, like, if he misses putting it on, he, like, freaks out. Yeah. Oh, I need to keep one in the car. <laughs> <laughs> so... I got him into that. I don't think I can get him into doing it all over his body, but if men do like it, I I'm do sell it in men's there. fragrance as well. I guess during winter. I during winter, yeah. yeah for dry. But I use it religiously because I will have youthful skin. <laughs> Anyways, we're going to end it here. I'm going to link everything for you guys. If I miss anything, just let me know. Let us know if you want more videos like this, Obsessions. I'm going to try to get back into it and get you guys seeing our even holiday stuff. I'm lucky for yeah, about yeah. that. I know, he's like, slow down, woman, it's still summer. Only for 12 more days is today. Well, this year you went a little bit crazy on Halloween. Halloween. But in my defense, I think I'm pretty much set on Christmas, no? Yeah. Somewhat? 
I mean, we buy little things here and there, but I'm pretty much set. Anyways, we're going to end it here. If you love it, hashtag love it. Be subscribed. Hit the bell so you're notified every time we post a video. And until next time, bye, y'all.